Welcome to Slide Egg. Today, I'm going to show you something really cool, how to fracture a picture in PowerPoint. It's super easy, and the result looks amazing. Let's get started. First, open your PowerPoint presentation. Now, select the rectangle shape from the toolbar and drag it vertically across the slide. Here's a little trick, press Ctrl plus D to quickly duplicate the shape. Do this a few times so you have several rectangles lined up. Pretty easy, right? Next, select all the shapes, go to the Align Options, and click Distribute Horizontally. This will space them out evenly, and you can adjust the placement to get everything just right. Once that's done, head over to Shape Outline. Change the outline color to white, and let's make the lines thicker by increasing the outline width. This step really makes the shape stand out. Now, here comes the fun part. Right-click on the group of shapes and choose Group. This will combine all the shapes into one object. Then, right-click again, go to Format Shape, and select Picture or Texture Fill. We're going to fill these shapes with an image. Click Insert, and choose a picture. For this demo, I'm going with a stock image. I searched for, Sunset. Picked one I liked, and hit Insert. And there it is, a beautiful fractured image effect. To make it even more eye-catching, you can add a shadow. Go to the Shadow Options, pick Offset Right, and tweak the settings until it looks perfect. Want to take it a step further? You can repeat this process on another shape. Add a new picture, and create even more effects. And that's it. You've just learned how to fracture a picture in PowerPoint. It's simple but gives such a unique look to your slides. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope you found it helpful.